guys, it's Rose with Rose Likes Crochet. How is everybody doing? I am not sure what day you are seeing this video simply because this is part two of the sixth wings update for October. And as I mentioned in one of the previous videos, I'm having trouble, technical difficulties uploading videos. So um, this time we had 32 uh, donations and I split it up into two separate videos. So if you have not seen part one, go back and watch part one. Uh, but for those of you who are new here, my name is Rose. I like to crochet. I like yarn a lot and I make stitch markers. I just had an Etsy shop update. So go on over to my Etsy shop. The link is down below and go and check it out. I do appreciate it. Um, so I do live here in the Chicago area. I have one daughter. Her nickname is Carrots, like the vegetable. And we have a bunch of animals in this place so we call it the zoo. So only one furry creature because he's a hunting dog and he cannot have another furry creature in the house. So um, I have mentioned him before in past videos. His name is Camo and he is a lab coonhound mix. So he is crazy, but he's awesome. So anyway, this year, along with last year, you guys helped with a domestic violence organization based here in the Chicago area called Wings. All of their links will be down below in the description box. And um, one thing I would like to mention is that if you shop on Amazon, you can go to smile.amazon.com and choose Wings as your charity. And a very small percentage of what you purchase will be donated to them. So that's a great way to donate without actually having to send anything. Okay, so like I mentioned, um, this, this section or this part of the video will have 16 donations. We had 32 donations that I just picked up from the post office. And um, for anyone who's wondering, the month of October, they asked for washcloths, dishcloths, face scrubbies, kitchen scrubbies, towel toppers, and uh, bath poofs and things like that. Um, for November, they are asking for toys for boys as well as chunky baskets. So you can also go check out the Wings playlist and there are a few video tutorials that I found that might be helpful for you um, if you are interested in donating for November. Okay, so we have 16 donations for this part. So do you guys wanna get started? All right, so the first package that I have came from Jacqueline from Oregon, and she had a couple of different piles in here. She has notes. So one says scrubbies, half are tool and half are cotton. And so let me see if that is, um, oh, these are so cool. Okay, so these are the ones that she's talking about. So there's tool, and then the other side is cotton. Oh, what a great idea. Oh my gosh, those are so, so cool. Okay, so these are the ones that are half tulle and half cotton. And then she's got, um, oh, there's a note. Hold on, guys, there's a note. <laughs> I didn't even see it here. All right, so she says, Hello, Rose, my name is Jackie, and I am 76 years young. I have been crocheting and knitting since I was 20, yet I am still learning new stitches and am recently learning to sew. Oh my gosh, you're my hero. My favorite quick things to make are washcloths and scrubbies, but my family, friends, neighbors, and social groups tell me that they have enough already. <laughs> okay, so shut the front door and open the back one. However, when I looked at your YouTube channel, wow, you have a huge landslide of many thousands of wash slash dishcloths. Congratulations, so sweet of all those who donated. I am only sending one Christmas dishcloth and a few experimental scrubbies. Enclosed is a notepad for you, but feel free to give it away. Um, okay, so here's the notepad. Oh, that's so pretty, thank you. Um, also, I made a little hat ornament for Crystal at Bag O'Day. Okay, so hold on, there's more scrubbies here. This stuff says scrubby, and it says one purple square which is this one. And it says two purple rounds, which is which are these. And it says half red heart scrubby yarn and half sugar and cream cotton. Okay, so there's like two scrubbies, two squares and two circles. Those are awesome. And then here is the ornament for Crystal. Oh my gosh. 
for those of you who don't don't know this was before crystal put out her post office box um i offered to collect ornaments for crystal uh, crystal is at bago de crochet and she bought a new house and she's going to have a 12 foot christmas tree and she agreed to let us send a christmas ornament for her so a lot of people who are sending in their wings donations are also sending in ornaments for crystal so <laughs> this is a little hat ornament for crystal oh my gosh could that be any cuter Oh my goodness. Thank you so, so much, Jackie, for sending these awesome items in. Let me see if she says anything else here. She says, um, blessings on your time and energy from Jackie. Jackie, thank you so much for sending all the amazing scrubbies and the washcloth. And these are really cool too. I really like those. And I will make sure that Crystal gets the little hat ornament from you. So thank you so much. Okay, next. So the next package comes from someone with the first initial M. There was no note in the bag, but they are from Oregon. So if that's you from Oregon, thank you so much for sending these. This is a whole stack of dishcloths that was in the package. And I do do really appreciate um, you guys sending in these washcloths for Wings. It means more um, to the people at Wings than you'll ever probably know. So one that really caught my eye in here was, I know it's knitted, and I don't knit, but I think that's absolutely beautiful. I don't know if I would even wanna do that, use it on my dishes. Like I would probably use it as like a coaster or something. So M, thank you so much for sending in these awesome, awesome dish class. I do appreciate it. Okay, next. You guys, I lied. <laughs> there was a card, it was stuck in the bag. Oh my gosh. Okay, so it says, Rose, thank you. And thanks to all that contribute in any way they can. Take care from Melissa. Melissa, thank you so much for sending those. I'm sorry I didn't get to say this <laughs> when you when I was showing your washcloths. But Melissa, I really do appreciate the washcloths that you did send. And um, thank you so much. All right, so the next package comes from Allison and Allison is from Connecticut and I promise I did not I'm looking right now I did not see a note <laughs> so she had in there this bag of scrubbies those are awesome I should try and start making some of these square ones those are pretty cool and there's a round one there and then there was an ornament for crystal in there look at how pretty that is can you guys even see that Oh my gosh, there's like little sparklies on there. Thank you so, so much. This is from Allison. So thank you so much. I will make sure that Crystal gets this. Okay, next. The next package comes from another person with just a first initial and there is a card and there's no name on there, but it's L and L is from Tennessee. And this is the card. Oh, thanks so much, you guys. It says, thank you for all that you do and to have this opportunity to donate to Wings. I learned my stitches from Bag o Day Crochet and uh, Ashley at Heart Hook Home. Big hugs from Elle. Well, big hugs back at you. So here are this the stacks, <laughs> the stack of washcloths. And there's even a little square scrubby there. That's awesome. And check this out, you guys. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. I love that. Thank you so, so much, Elle, for sending all of these beautiful, beautiful washcloths. I do really appreciate it. Okay, next. So you guys, the next package was this big package here and there's no return address on it. So the only thing that I can see is a zip code and it looks like it's uh, 63028. That's all I got on here. So whoever you are from 63028, thank you so much for sending all of these beautiful washcloths these gorgeous bright colors. Oh my goodness. I absolutely love them. So thank you so much. You guys can remain anonymous if you want to. That's no problem. Or if you want to leave me a note and just tell me not to say your name, that's no problem either. So thank you so much. Whoever sent these, they're beautiful. Okay, so the next item is actually didn't actually come in the mail. So I got an Etsy shop order um, yesterday and um, it was for a Spider-Man lovey. So I was getting ready to package it up and ship it off. And I noticed there was a note because um, you can leave a note to the seller when you make an Etsy purchase. And the note said um, something to the effect of Rose, please donate this to Wings for November's Toys for Boys. Oh my gosh. 
So I did message the buyer and asked her if it was okay that I say her name uh, and that she donated this to this lovey and I'll show you guys the lovey in a second. And it is from Susan from Virginia. So Susan from Virginia went on my Etsy shop and you guys don't definitely don't have to do this, but I really do appreciate. This is so cool. This is the lovey that she bought from my Etsy shop. She bought Spider-Man. How perfect is that for a toy for a boy? It would also be great for a toy for a girl, um, but November they're asking for toys for boys. So she purchased this off my Etsy shop and I really, really do appreciate um, that you supported me and you're supporting Wings. Um, it means more than you, you guys actually will know. So Susan from Virginia, thank you so much for doing this and I will make sure that this gets to Wings in November. Okay, next. So the next box came from Emma and Emma is from New York and I did not see a card in the box. But what I do have is three baggies that are completely filled with washcloths here. Oh my gosh, Emma, you've been so busy. Here is another one that's filled with washcloths. I love them. Look at the pattern on that one. That is so cool. And then here is another one and there's a couple washcloths in there. So I'm going to leave those in there. And then there was a box inside the box and it says Merry Christmas on it. So I'm thinking this is an ornament for Crystal. So let's see what's in here. So there is a card for Crystal and it is taped. So I'm not going to open up the card. Um, but this is what the ornament was that she sent. Oh my God. It's a gnome holding a wreath. Could that be any cuter, you guys? Like he's got his beard underneath there and everything. Oh my gosh, Emma, that is so, so cute. How adorable. Now, anyone who sends ornaments and I show them in wings, I will show them in a, in a separate video as well for ornaments for crystals. So you guys will hopefully see this again in the, in the last update for crystals ornaments. So Emma, thank you so much for sending this for crystal and thank you so much for sending the wash class for wings. I do appreciate it. Okay, next. All right, you guys, the next package comes from Stephanie and she's from California. Hi, my best friend actually is named Stephanie and she's from California too, but this is not her. <laughs> All right, she sent this bag of washcloths and she's got a note taped on here and it says, hi Rose, seven washcloths for wings. Hopefully Pamela at Pamela's Adoring Crochet is watching. Thank you, Rose, and everyone who donates for all your hard work. You all rock from Stephanie from California. So for those of you who aren't familiar, Pamela from Pamela's Adoring Crochet is running a contest on her channel, and she's keeping track of the washcloths that are donated um, That when people heard from her about it. Okay, so here are all the washcloths. They are amazing, especially that one because it's so Stephanie, thank you so much for sending those. I really do appreciate it. All right, so the next package comes from Danita and Danita is from Washington. And there was no note in the bag that I could find. Of course, we all know what happened at the last one. Um, but she sent this stack of washcloths right here. And she even sent what looks like oh, this beautiful set. Okay, so this is all like the same yarn. It's like trimmed in something. And then there's even little um, face scrubbies to go with it. So that is awesome. Like little tiny one and then medium sized ones. So Danita, thank you so much for sending in these beautiful washcloths and the set. I really do appreciate it. Okay, next. The next box comes from Kelly and she's from Wisconsin. And I got a You Are Mermazing. <laughs> That's awesome. And she writes, oh, it's in green ink. Okay, let me see if I can read this. Hi, Rose. A few more face slash dishcloths to add to the thousands you already received. What a great year it has been. Uh, seeing all the donations this year. Blessings from Kelly. Okay, so yes, Kelly, it is amazing, right? So here is the stack from Kelly. And the one that caught my eye, was, of course, was sparkly <laughs> because I'm all about the bling bling. That's awesome. 
So Kelly, thank you so much for sending this stack of washcloths. I do appreciate everyone who donates. And if you donate more than once, that's absolutely incredible, but you definitely don't have to. All right, next. So the next package comes from DeAndrea and she's from Florida. And there were two baggies in the box and one baggie says just two wings and it has my name on it. And then the other one has a little heart post-it note and it says 12 washcloths. So she's got them folded up so nicely. You can see there's different patterns on there. So it looks like there's probably six in here. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. And then there's another bag filled with washcloths. Oh my gosh, you guys are washcloth making machines, seriously. It's incredible. DeAndrea, thank you so much for sending these. You guys, um, it means a lot to the people at Wings and the people here on YouTube that get to see your incredible generosity. So, all right, let's get to the next one. So the next box came from Jennifer from Colorado and I didn't see a note in the box. And this is how it was stacked in the box. It was like layered. Oh my gosh, this whole stack is all the same style of dishcloth. So I'm gonna show you guys. And Jennifer, if you could leave a comment on what pattern you used, that would be amazing. So they're all this exact style, but they're all different colors. So let me see if I can show you guys the different colors because they're just beautiful. Oh my goodness, like seriously, this is incredible. Okay, here's another color gorgeous. I would love, love, love to know what the pattern is on these. Okay, so these are the same. Okay, so these look like um, what, candy corn? No, Halloween. I don't know. Candy corn Halloween. They're beautiful. Okay, and then here is this black one. Oh my gosh. Here is blue and purple. Oh my gosh, these are just gorgeous. Check this one out with the greens in it. Okay, I definitely need to know what the pattern is on this for sure. Okay, here's some red ones. See, that's a lot of sewing in of ends. <laughs> here's a yellow one. I just love these. Okay, hold on. There's only a few more, you guys. This is a pretty blue and green one. And then I think, um, yeah, that's it. So this huge stack of these flowery washcloths is absolutely incredible. So Jennifer, thank you so, so much for sending these. That is awesome. Okay, next. The next package comes from Teresa and she's from Minnesota and she sent this card. Oh, you guys are so sweet. She writes, Rose, Carrots, and the Zoo. Hope this finds you well and safe. Just wanted to say thank you for all you do to help all of us have an outlet for our creative side. And to everyone that donates, you are amazing. P.S. Tell Carrots Hello. Love Teresa's handmade gifts. Oh my gosh, Teresa, you're awesome. Okay, so this stack is incredible. Look at that, you guys. Okay, so of course I have to show you this one because it's purple, but it's also very pretty. And Teresa, if you could let me know what the design is on that one or what pattern you use, because that is gorgeous. I love it. It's beautiful. Teresa, thank you so, so much for donating to Wings. I like you guys are amazing, amazing. Okay, next. All right, you guys, the next package comes from someone that I love a lot. She's actually donated um, a project bag as a thank you gift for every month for wings for this year and her name is Jennifer and she's from a YouTube channel called Crafty Bones. So if you guys have not checked her out, she is incredibly talented. She sews like a mad woman and obviously crochets like one too. <laughs> and I do have a note from her. So I am going to link her down below. Please go and check her out. And she writes, um, Dear Rose, I'm sorry I was unable to make any more washcloths than those enclosed here. Seriously, you're apologizing for this? Okay, that's not acceptable. <laughs> um, and she says, it has just become so painful to crochet and I need my hands for work. Even putting on sterile gloves has become difficult. Oh, I lost my mother on September 28th and have not made any videos for a while to encourage others to send more to you. That's no problem. It's no problem. 
At least when this was mailed out, I hadn't. I am hoping to make one this weekend. I will remind everyone to get them to you before November. I cannot wait for you to see my new craft room, complete purple overload if there is such a thing. There is no such thing. Your friend in yarn, Jennifer Crafty Bones. So she did just post a video, I think it was a day or two ago, and her craft room is like the most gorgeous shade of purple and it's all purple and I am so jealous. <laughs> so let's talk about this um, small stack of washcloths from Jennifer at Crafty Bones. Oh my gosh. Okay, so there's a couple that you have to see you guys. This one is like the peppermint swirl. That is so cool. Then she's got a bunch of like rainbow ones. I love these. Okay, here's a bunch that are rainbow but they're square. So just so you guys can see what a slacker she is. Like, really? Oh my gosh, look at all of these rainbow ones. I love them. Okay, and then she's got this color here of washcloths, and then she's got red ones, and then she's got burgundy ones. Seriously? And then she's got a stack all of this color. So Jennifer, first of all, I am so sorry to hear about your mom and I hope that you can find a way to heal um, quickly with your hands. And second of all, I appreciate you donating to Wings. And third of all, I would like an invite to come and craft with you in your purple yarn room. <laughs> I think you're only a couple hours away from me, so we can we can manage that, right? All right, guys, we have two more packages. The next box comes from Romaine, and she's from Colorado, and she sent a note, and it says, Hi, you doll, another box full of love. There are all kinds of shapes and sizes inside, colors too. Thank you for getting us involved. Um, our Yarny community sure knows how to give. Love to you and all the zoo from Romaine. Okay, so she sent a huge box, and they're all folded so nicely, but here is one stack of washcloths. There's four stacks here, you guys. Oh my goodness gracious. Here is another stack. Yes, all colors, shapes, and sizes are just fine. I never heard anyone complain about the shape or color of their washcloth. Here is another stack right here. Oh my goodness. Okay, and then look at how cool this is. Like it's got, oh, it's like a little back, back scrubber thing. It's got the handles on it. That is so cool. So here is a stack of those um, back scrubbers. Wow, Romaine, thank you so much for taking the time to make all these and send them to Wings. I really, really do appreciate it. Okay, we have one more box, but it is monstrous. All right, you guys, the next box comes from Molly and Molly is from Texas. And I'm just gonna show you real quick how big the box, I had to empty it. There's no way I could pick it up with all the stuff in it. That's the box that Molly sent. Okay, so, and you can see there's a lot of stuff right here. All right, she sent a note. She says, Dear Rose, thank you for giving all us crocheters an outlet for our creativity and to diminish our yarn stashes. <laughs> Crocheting these things for wings has been my therapy all summer and into fall. It has helped me focus on something other than my anxiety. Enclosed is some yarn to be used as thank you gifts. Okay, so let's, so here is one bag of the yarn for thank you gifts and then here is oh this is really pretty here is the other one so thank you so much for sending the yarn for thank you gifts and then she says the washcloth space scrubby shower poofs and other things were made with either sugar and cream peaches and cream hobium xl cotton premier cotton cotton cakes and i am sure a few others patterns were from from anywhere i could find them i tried to not repeat stitches too many times I discovered a few things crocheting these, um, including <laughs> one, I would rather not do puff stitches. Okay, good to know. And number two, scrubby yarn is for the birds. I have used it and won't again. Hope all is well with you, Carrots and the Zoo. Hugs from Molly and her zoo. P.S. My zoo is five cats, two dogs, three guinea pigs, and nine rats. No reptiles yet. Okay, I got you covered on the reptiles. So for those of you who don't know, I have, it's not mine, it's my daughter's. I have a leopard gecko. I have, we have a bearded dragon and we have a, 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 a Greek land tortoise. So I got you covered on tortoise, on uh, reptiles. Okay, are you guys ready? Because the pile is amazing here. 
So she has everything like all wrapped up. So I'm not gonna take anything out of like the piles and the box is right here. So I'm gonna toss them in there <laughs> so we can get through this. Okay, so she's got them like all like tied together. So there's one stack there. Here is another stack there. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. Here we go, another one and another stack. Oh my gosh, these are awesome. Okay, and then here are two more. These did not have a tie on them, but these did. So thank you for those. I'm going to actually keep those separate so they don't get caught all over the place. Here is another stack that's all tied together or two more stacks that are tied together. There's like four or five washcloths in each one of these like little wrapped gifts. So I don't know if you guys are counting, but I'm not counting. So here is um, two more stacks. All right, there are some more. Oh my goodness, there's so many of them. That box was completely filled, you guys. There's more. I love these. This is so perfect. Oh my goodness gracious. I just love them. That that does it. It's a big stash buster for you, right? <laughs> okay, here's more. Those are big ones. Wow, thank you so much. Okay, and then we have ones that are like in um, tied together like this. They're the square ones. Awesome. So there's a stack there, there, another stack. Oh my gosh, look at these big Christmas ones. I love them. Oh my goodness. There's two more. This is so much. <laughs> and then there's two more like that. Then there's a whole bag here filled with washcloths. Okay, and then she's got another stack tied together. And then she's got these beautiful ones. Oh my gosh, I love them. Okay, and then she has these little um, little ones with the teddy bear ears or kitty cat ears. Oh my gosh, look at how cute they are. I just love those. Okay, and then here's some little face scrubbies adorable here's more like that and then we've got these scrubbies right here that she tied together <laughs> oh my gosh so this is what they look like and then there's another stack in this color right here beautiful okay, and then she included two boxes in the box and this box says 11 shower poofs Okay, so this is what I call the brains of the operation, you guys. <laughs> so they're the shower poofs, and um, they have the little hangy thing, and then um, those are awesome. Oh my gosh, I love them. And then there's another box here, and it says on the box, 140 face scrubbies. Holy smack rolls. Look at that, you guys. That is incredible. Did you do anything else like this whole year? You just did these? This is awesome. Oh my gosh. Molly, thank you so, so much for donating to Wing, sending this monstrous box with the scrubbies and the shower poofs and the washcloths. It's absolutely incredible what you guys can do. Um, I appreciate the fact that I asked for these things and you guys delivered like, like, in abundance, in abundance. It's incredible. So that is it for today. I'm sure that I will see you guys in a couple days with another Wings Update video, and I hope you guys all have a great night. Bye!